This video is going to show a few examples for solving vertical adjacent complementary angles level one problems within the Delta Math online system. So here we're given um, two lines intersect and creates uh, four angles. They give us one measurement, 147. So from there, we can find all the other angle measures, right? So for B, what's the relationship between B and the 147? Those are vertical angles. And we know that vertical angles are congruent. So this angle here is 147 degrees. Now, what's the relationship between either angle B and C or the original 147 and C? You should see that they form a linear pair. So they are going to be supplementary. So to figure out the measure angle C, we're just going to go C plus 147 has to equal 180 degrees. We subtract 147 from both sides. And if you didn't write an algebraic equation, you just go 180 minus 147. Uh, but we're going to get, what's that, 33 degrees? So this is 33. Now, just be careful when you type it into delta math that you put the proper number with the letter, the proper variable, right? So variable B is going to be the 147, and variable C is going to be the 33. All right, and we hit submit, and we got the check mark. Here's our next problem. This time it gives us a linear pair, right? We know that these are two angles along one side of a line. Uh, those two add up to the straight angle, which we know is 180 degrees. Um, so this is simply A plus 20 equals 180. We're going to subtract 20 from both sides, or you may have just went 180 minus 20, and we get A equals 160 degrees. So we're going to type that into delta math. Confirm we are correct. And we get the check mark. Let's do one more example. This time we have two angles within a right angle, right? So we can use the angle addition postulate where these two angles, angle A and, and 31, are going to equal the 90. Uh, we also can call these that these are complementary angles, right? Two angles that add up to 90 degrees. So we either just write an equation A plus 31 equals 90. And we subtract 31 from both sides. And we're going to get, what's that, 59 degrees. So A equals 59. Or you could just simply went 90 degrees minus 31 on your calculator. And we enter in the 59 to confirm that we are correct. And that's it for these problems.